the end of this past Tuesday's SmackDown Live, it was revealed that WWE owner Vince McMahon would be making an appearance on SmackDown next week to address the current situation between former US champion Kevin Owens and the now suspended commissioner Shane McMahon. Tensions have been rising for the last several months between Shane McMahon and Kevin Owens. Owens believes Shane is responsible for him losing the United States Championship to AJ Styles and that he has a personal vendetta against him. Shane has tried to remain as neutral as he can possibly be as SmackDown Live Commissioner but this week Kevin Owens crossed a line that was too much for Shane, telling Shane that his family, especially his kids would have been better off if he hadn't survived his recent helicopter crash. Shane brutally attacked Owens having to be dragged away by security and Daniel Bryan, who later confronted Shane in the ring following a phone call from the chairman of the board Vince McMahon who instructed Daniel Bryan to indefinitely suspend his son after Owens threatened to sue every member of the McMahon family. Smackdown Live is due to take place in Las Vegas next week and WWE posted the following on WWE. Com about Vince McMahon's imminent return to the blue brand. Their animosity between Kevin Owens and Shane McMahon has reached its boiling point, and only one person can perhaps put an end to it, Mr. McMahon. The WWE chairman and CEO will be at Sin City Smackdown next week to address the bad blood between his son and K.O., which boiled over Tuesday night on Smackdown Live. After Shane attempted to stop Owens from again making himself referee for a match, K.O. crossed the line by insulting Shane's family. The insults sent Shane over the edge, as he immediately pummeled Owens, tackled him over the announced desk and continued to throw haymakers before finally being pulled off by officials and arena security. After Owens threatened to sue WWE and the entire McMahon family and press criminal charges against Shane, Mr. McMahon phoned SmackDown Live general manager Daniel Bryan with a difficult decision that had to be made. The chairman suspended Shane indefinitely as SmackDown Live commissioner. Though Bryan thought that would have ended the situation, it was not enough for Owens, who vowed to make Sin City SmackDown his personal playground and Bryan's personal nightmare. K.O. said there was nothing Brian could do about it, to which Brian agreed, but quickly notified Owens of Mr. McMahon's intentions for next week. What does Mr. McMahon have in store for Owens? Tune into Sin City Smackdown Live next Tuesday at 87C on USA Network to find out. The next Smackdown Live PPV takes place at Hell in a Cell on October 8th in Detroit. It's unknown as yet what action Vince McMahon will take next week, but he will be sure to want to avoid any legal action from Kevin Owens and may look to offer up Shane to Owens in a Hell in a Cell match to appease the former Universal Champion. Shane was visibly upset at the prospect of losing his job as SmackDown Live Commissioner and although he clearly regretted his actions, he would no doubt love a chance to once again get his hands on the man that has antagonized him for months.